that skill up. Yeah, it looks like Monster is going to be dropping out of their uh, their mod as being requested by the refs. It is technically against the rules, so, you know, it's better to follow the rules, guys. And then we're going to get things started. Yeah, save that for holiday week. Condor holiday. Yeah, we, we have some events where we totally allow total graphic stuff, but, you know, this is the, the real deal. And the main reason we're doing this is for your opponent. We don't want the... Uh, opponent to see stuff that's confusing or weird or, you know, as they are screen watching. Yeah, it was game text. Like, the rider was a heckin' rider. Yeah, yeah. So the item. Like, that actually Small could things. matter. Like, what killed your opponent? What? Whoa. Look at it's this start. Hidden. Wait. Ravio. Ravio, Ravio. Ravio is back will there. Ravio will see it. Will he? Just okay. R. R. He, he does. Going back. Going back. Yeah, yeah. That, uh, if only you had the um, Ring of Darkness coming into that. That's the perfect Ring of Darkness arena. <laughs> would you would you ever take Ring of War over Electro Dagger? Um, on a run back, if there's like a rapier coming up. So you won't do it until you know there's a rapier. Yeah, I, I don't think. I think this is a better. This is already two damage, so your damage is equal, but this weapon is better. Sure. Or an axe, yeah. Yeah, I just wonder, like, if the odds for a good ring are lower than the odds for a good weapon, right? Um. True. That yeah. would be the that would be the case for taking the ring. You're like, okay. Yeah, I, I can see that. I will be a little bit behind in zone one, and then after a black chest or whenever I farm up, I'll be faster. Yeah, I think that's a fair point. Plus the uh, ring also makes all the weapons better, right? Like, any weapon, like, there's... It's okay to run a base rapier if you've got the, uh... you got the Ring of War. Sure. Yeah, but the Zap Dagger oh, is just then, too good. Yeah, it's just so good. As we can see, it's zapping the entire Congo line. Oh, Ravio got a little bit of armor. Some fake armor. Yep, just grabbing that. It can be useful. Um... That little find is probably good and, and somewhat indicative of what we said, where Ravio is a bit more of a farming style. Mm -hmm. Monster Racer is more of a push kind of style. Getting some bombs, and there is an Earth spell there. Ravio is going to want to grab that. Might even check this. I'm just going to bomb it. Oh, oh okay. Nice torch. little value bomb. Yeah, not what you want, though. Big glass. Jaw, jaw, jaw. Nope, oh. not gonna jaw. <laughs> it's not that good with this, because you're only just doing four damage. <laughs> no, the four damage shot. Yeah. Not worth the danger. Was it shoes in there? What? What was in there? Was there not a shovel, or they just don't have the money? I missed them going into the glass shop. Oh, it was a torch. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Wind Mage was sneaking in there for Monster Racer, trying to mess up their Leprechaun. Oh, there's a uh, Rapier. Okay. Could have had, you know, Mega Damage Rapier with Glass. Yeah, I think John. I think it's the right call to not. I think... Uh, <laughs> yeah, okay. Better to, If you're getting a bunch of health, it's better to have the ability to use it. And if you take the Glass oh, sure. Rapier, you can't sure. use it. Sure. We'll use break. it for your, uh, your spells. Your spells. That's true. Unfortunately, these are two of the not as fast spells. Freeze and shield would be faster spells, but Earth has its uses. It's Defensive Earth. Earth. Is really good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, even more Earth. All right, Zone Three. It looks like it's left up. Is the exit? Nope. Maybe. Yes. Somewhere left. Oh yeah, it might be right next to the shop. Yeah. Oh, we got some boots. Nice. Yeah, it's gonna be right at the shop opening there. Or not right at it, but okay, what is this there. layout? It's huge. Yeah. Sometimes it's. Oh man, it's the square really footage smaller. on this one. The value. Oh. Yeah, Monster Racer, Racer taking some hits. Yeah. It's off a little. Yeah, his health drops pretty fast when you don't have any armor on. Yeah, Monster doesn't have glass armor and never found the. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay, we there's are, a ham. Oh, back. that is such a nice. Boots. Oh, 
Ooh, that is pulse. such a nice earth. Whoa. Yeah, the pulse spell. Nice. Pulse earth is nice what earth you want. To, to save themselves from that surround. Now both dropping off those lead boots, so losing protection from uh, ice and goo, which is a little scary, but the plus one damage means they're now at the three damage threshold, which is pretty good. Yeah. He's... Sure. It's hard to get Sorali caught up with a dagger in zone, f in zone four on the goo, so it's not as big of a risk as, say, a broadsword. And that's why you want three damage there. That kill on the dragon would have been much less safe mm. if you had two damage when I had to back off and might have got hit. <laughs> throw bomb. Throw pulse. Okay. I'll throw pulse, sure. Or earth, I guess. Yeah, both are fine. I guess you have to throw because if you hit the if you hit the pawn with the electro dagger, you might uh, force him to teleport anyway. So it's like a couple beats faster. I maybe take that pulse scroll. I don't know. Safe dead Over ringers, ham? nice. Yeah. Over a ham. I yeah, the know. ham's probably the key. Whew. Maybe not. Maybe instead of the tomes, if you're monster. Oh, okay. Yeah, with the, when you have the spell, the tomes aren't nearly as good. All right, monkey to monkey on monster racer side. <laughs> it's true, Cupy, but I think it's a slower one, right? Isn't the pulse faster for a dead ringer kill? Well, that was a really nice exit for uh, on four like damage. Yeah, just the ten damage hit versus like squishing them and then kind of being stuck inside some walls and then. Oh sure, yeah, I guess. Earth is faster than teleport pulse? after you hit him. Hmm. I don't know. Okay, well, a really good zone four for uh, Monster Racer. Ravio gonna fall a little bit behind, but did do some farming for a shovel. I don't know if that Ooh. big dig's gonna make the difference here. Probably wanted that pink shovel. Oh, nice. Electro dagger and pulse, so good. Yeah. But Monster Racer just like. Firing through. Tanking all the hits. Has all the health. Has all the earths. It's got a real Captain Planet going on with the Earths, the electrics, <laughs> the pulse. Yeah, that's right. Over all of them. Yeah, electricity, pulse, heart, fish. Yeah, all the hearts. Too. What was yeah, it? Right? Uh, uranium, I think, was one. Was that one of them? <laughs> it was definitely not a uranium. No? No. Oh. No, no. I mean, maybe Canadian. Uh, Captain <laughs> Canadian Planet knockoff anyway. Captain Planet. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Captain with an E on the end. And then a lot of use planet with some use in it. <laughs> he had the money. He could have just gotten the H plate. <laughs> nope. Oh, wow. These scoots. Oh, the earth squish mix. Nice squish. All right. So a slight lead here for monster. Ravio is going to do uh, oblivion strat. Love sure. it. It's a good strat. Uh, it's a lot. It was a little okay, off because of that earth kill, but or the pulse kill, but uh, he waited yeah. to beat appropriately. And one hit already for Monster Racer out of six. Ravio just getting into the fight now. So it's looking Monster Racer. Um, some excellent pushes given that Monster Racer had the weaker build for much of the run and the lead, which of course you can't draft when you're winning. Oh, that was so fast. That was a really good fight. So Monster yeah. Racer taking game one. GG's. Reminders, this is the Losers Bracket Finals. Winner of this goes to the Grand Finals. Loser of this gets third place in the tournament. This is a best of five match. And Monster Racer winning. Ravio not too far behind. Look at that in-game time, though. Hold up. Huh. There was a reset. There was a reset. There was Ravio a reset. The, he went right at the beginning. Yeah, missed out on the, the arena. Just checking. Just checking, making sure. That happens from time to time. Yeah, that there was a good telemonkey on monster side for zone four. And just the handling of all the exit rooms was super good. Yeah, I think actually Ink Nun hit the nail on the head. It was zone four. Uh, monster zone four was incredible. Like they were pretty much neck and neck. And then by the end, monster was like a full floor, zone four floor ahead. It's good to see you, Ink. Ink Nun, one of our season winners. Good to mm. see the uh, champions looking down from on high. Judging. <laughs> yeah, that's how I imagine it. <laughs> They're like in Mount Olympus, just hmm. 
my my think I think my natural think down imagination pose is like the thinking man pose. Totally. You know? Yeah. Yep, maybe think maybe none. at a bridge table yep. or something like that. Yeah. Ooh, blood shops real nice and monsters missing this. Oh my goodness. This is a huge miss for Monster Racer. Whoa, the Ravio farming. This is an incredible blood shop to start with. Monster's gonna need to get bailed out big time. Now there is a Blast Helm there in 1-3. But like, holy smokes, look at that. Oof. Yeah, that's really strong. So that Rapier, of course, could be your weapon for the game, but even if yeah. not, it's good for now because the gold kills. I'm a big fan of the gold Rapier. We got the armor. First. Oh, what? 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 Uh, can uh, we no find bombs. a bomb? No, no bombs. No bomb. okay. There is a, a Blast Helm coming up, but this is this is like Necrodancer deciding to just say, hey, you know, uh, I think farming's hey, better. Rabio. So I'm just going to give the person who farms the win because right now Monster Racer is running a Titanium Whip. <laughs> yeah, the build differential is so crazy. I mean, he's got the lead. So there's that. We can't ignore that fact. But for how long? I think not very. Yeah, this is some uh, 2020 election results right now. Looking like one's ahead, but it's not <laughs> the case. Some yep. states haven't been counted yet. Fraud. Oh yeah, Ravio here. Uh... <laughs> that's actually pretty accurate. I think that's like a good analogy. It's like you know what's coming still. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> no yeah. yeah. All right. I mean, this is so good. He has Earth spell too somehow. Oh, nice find though with the. Is that the purple the health shop? Monster racers Maybe still was, struggling. Yeah, it probably it was probably purple chest right from uh, one four. Oh man, war whip. <laughs> I mean, whip is good for boss kills. Look at this. See? Look at it. Boom. It's good Done. for death metal. It's good for death metal. All boss kills. Especially <laughs> dead ringer. I mean, try dead ringer with a whip. It's like not possible. If you have a whip on dead ringer, it's your own fault. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Well, he's got a, a glass spear, which actually could be enough with the lead that he's currently got. Um, but the word could is doing a lot of heavy lifting there. Have we ever had like a a, a bad uh, event like where we only have all the terrible items like whips and broadswords? I mean, meme door is a pretty bad event. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> and yeah, crossbows. Our dance bad tournament was also a pretty bad event. <laughs> sure. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't know. Um, <laughs> We, I mean, yeah, in Meme Door, we have done where it's like you're forced to play like Cat Courage Monk or whatever. Oh, We've done sure. that. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, that heal spell's coming in pretty clutch right now. Ravio, I mean, does have a lot of hearts, but has a lot of empty oh, hearts, too. Monster can Courage Shovel and like immediately needing to use it. Oh. <laughs> Just like surrounded by all these riders. Uh, Monster's build is really good now. Like, really good. Like. This is a pretty straight ahead, home. straight ahead Thanks quality so build. Yeah. And Ravio going the wrong way. I think it's straight up is the exit. Oh, no, it's not. It's left. Yeah, Monster's build is, is really nice. We thought, like, Ravio was going to be... Way Ravio hard. keeps accidentally losing... Okay, is going for this um, pink shovel. And that's probably all Whoa. you take, because you got to go. Yeah, I mean, maybe this is the. I don't know if they needed to go there anymore. Like, man. Uh, I don't know. Pink shovel is really good. I guess you good. can't really pass on pink shovel. It's just so insane. I mean, it's the good, just like the good news for Ravio so is that um, the electro dagger is really strong, and this exit is gross. Um, but yeah, the whoa, hello monkey, Ravio. Okay, nice. that was nice. Move, move to room forward. Okay, and they have they have shield. Yeah, shield about courage. That and all the hard Courage is pretty good here. I think Ravio's got a shot to come back. Oh, Actually, yeah. he's got more than a shot. He's almost on the same room. What am I talking yeah. about? Come on, Elon. <laughs> Get your act together. Oh. Get your head in the game. Let's go. Come on. Yeah, just behind. Okay. 
No, oh my Whoa, god! Whoa, nice! We got shield spell. That's this is amazing. Crazy. That was like, that was actually the best. That, that was, was the not greatest. bad. That was like, the Look best. at this monkey. Here we go. Oh, insane. Oh man, just channeling the spirit of Goof. Yeah, seriously. Out of everyone that had a dream of beating Spooty Biscuit. Yeah, yeah, that's the way to do it. Get BS tele monkeys. <laughs> right. Right. Oh man. And that pink shovel now working nicely. What a turnaround for this race. The, <laughs> the results are coming in. It's 11 p.m. And here we um, go. It's like Sivir took Goof's power and then Ravio took Sivir's power, which includes Goof's power. Like Mega <laughs> oh Man's. man. We're Katamariing all the way up. <laughs> yeah, and, and like pretty unstoppable build now. Because, like, he's got oh, yeah. free, easy uh, shield spells every floor. Just push in. And what do you even yeah, do just... if you're if you're monster? You just hope he gets a bad map. But, oh, or you die. Oh, oh. yeah. I mean, Austria, they were behind. It's, it's like, understandable. What happened there? Oh. Oh, they were the trying to take the oh, wall. Oh, the Minotaur like the dug Minotaur the wall. Bopped the wall instead. Oh, oh man. That's pretty rude. Yeah. That's pretty rude, actually. That's where you you think the pink shovel's totally safe, and then the Minotaur opens the wall. That's a pretty rough death. That's now, actually really rough. I've never actually had that one happen to me before, but man. That reminds me of the time I was pink shoveling, and then I uh, a, an enemy moved at the exact wrong time for me to jump on a uh, scatter trap and immediately die. That was uh, oh, that's amazing. That was a good time. <laughs> now, yeah, he would have survived that had he eaten that ham. He was at two hearts out of four. And uh, I'm pretty oh, sure the Dark yeah. Golems don't do four hearts of damage. So it's a shame that, but you know, when you're pushing, I don't blame yeah, him. I guess. You don't expect to die there. Definitely not. No, no, not when you expect to dig the wall. Like very clearly, it, it looks like he should have dug the wall down, right? Or they should have dug the wall. That so. was a sub seven in game. Insane. Uh, Ravio taking a win and tying up. We are now in best of three territory because uh, our best of five tied up on the first two matches. Let's get our big moment, and that was this Telemonkey. Watch on the next floor. This is 4-2. As soon as Ravio gets to the next floor, gets an insane Telemonkey. The best Telemonkey I think I've ever seen. Boom. Oh, it's such a good Telemonkey. Insane. All right, let's do it. Yeah, chat cover in the game. Yeah, that rhythm based roguelike. Yeah, welcome. Man, it's it's awesome. Well, of course I'm gonna say that after having put, you know, thousands of hours into this game. Yeah, it's really fun. I guess since there are some new people who I just saw come in with a raid, thanks so much, Super Versus League. Uh yeah, this is a fun game. It's um it's one of a kind for sure. It's rhythm based roguelike. Um the way we always think about it is it's more of a turn based roguelike where the turns are locked to the music. And, of course, you're fighting your way through five floors, just like any other roguelike, uh, with a boss on each floor, making your way down to the final boss. Um, and it turns out it's an excellent yeah. game for racing. And so we've it's been doing this for a long, long time. Sorry, go ahead, Ryan. And the style is much more like a roguelike, like rogue-esque, uh, too, with the over-the-head view. Yeah, you get uh, equipment, sort of RPG style. Um, sure. But it is random, and our racers are playing the same seed, but it's a blind seed. They've not seen this seed before. And so what really makes racing this game fascinating is that these racers have developed the skills to read the levels and the layouts quickly and understand how the game um, puts itself together, generates, so that you can um, go through your seed as quick as possible. And then it's a lot of sort of min-maxing, deciding like, oh, is this the, is this the right move at this time? Um, and yeah, it's a lot of decisions that you have to make relatively quickly and like planning out too. Oh, it's so cool. Yeah. Like if you're speed racing and I don't want to, you know, I'm not hating on like Mega Man X, one of my favorite games of all time, but if you're speed racing Mega Man X, it's a very different beast than speed racing this game. Uh, because sure. Mega Man X, it's like, you know, what's going to happen. You know, where the enemy positions are. Um, you're hoping for certain cycles, right? You got to pull things off that are frame perfect, that kind of thing. Whereas here it's completely different. You're trying to um, you're trying to use your game knowledge to put together the fastest run on any particular seed. Yep, and so even a little different from randomizers too. It's more full, procedurally generated. Yeah. Oh. 
Um, so this is actually a pretty interesting run right now. Um, oh, I was just about to say, you know, with Monster Racer running the whip, I know Monster Racer does not mind the whips. Um, Ravio, I'm not sure, but uh, we did just get a swap off to the Titanium Longsword. Uh, okay. Titanium Longsword, it is a two damage weapon um, and it does have range on your attack. And I'll show that right here. There we go. Yeah, I don't think we've we've run a not amplified DLC in a while, like race. No, we did do throwback door a little while back, where we sure. went and did like a the to zone three like ridiculous one. But yeah. Uh, but yeah, amplified. It really is one of the DLCs. Uh, one, it is a DLC that makes the game just better. There's only a couple reasons maybe to go back and run the original, and I think. If you're trying to beat Coda, that's one. Um, hmm. And then if you're trying to do the lowest of the low, that is another reason, um, that achievement. But otherwise, really, it's just better. The DLC is really good. There's a few things that people don't like about the DLC, but on the whole, it is much, much better than the uh, original game. Yeah. Nice. All right, we've got ourselves a pretty good shrine here. So we'll see if Monster oh, Racer nice. decides to get a weapon or a ring of peace. It looks like the ring of peace. Weird. What was teleport. that teleport? Yeah. Yeah, it was the bomb. I just don't know why they teleport there. Maybe the bomb still? didn't have directions associated with it, yeah. so then it didn't know where to teleport to. Uh, I don't know. That was weird. Something like that. Ooh, it's snow of, bro. Um, of like bopping the shrine and then getting a enchanted dagger. Yeah, well, that's kind of what I was wondering. I mean, this weapon is fine, but it's not that fast. And so picking right. up, uh, like, if you get an Electro Dagger, that's going to be really good. But, of course, you're running the risk of getting, like, Frost Dagger or something, sure, which is sure. worse. There's there's some bad some bad outcomes. Ooh, okay. Okay, Ravio. Yeah. Picking up that Miner Scap, too. Nice. Okay, I see Monster already doing that. You've seen people complain Ooh. about item bloat in this? Huh. What do people not like about the DLC? Um, I, I don't know, but maybe that's because I play Isaac. <laughs> You want to talk item bloat? <laughs> Play that game. I feel like the item pool is fine here. I mean, probably the things that we've removed from this game with the mod. Axes, leaping, lunging. True. I guess lunge, leaping, leaping was, in, was in before. Yeah. Actually, yeah, I think Jack's points are pretty good. You know, zone 5 isn't really... It, it's, it's easier. It's not faster than zone 4. Zone 4 is scarier. Oh, um, oh Monster Rancher. Monster Ooh. Rancher. Monster, Monster Rancher. Yikes. Yeah. yeah, but he does find the pink shovel there. The very thing Jack was talking about. Um, just in a chest. So we'll see if Ravio finds it. It's just to the right there. No, he's just going to push. Uh, but he has Miner's Ravio, Cap. Oh, they both have Miner's Cap. So never mind. <laughs> doesn't matter. Miner's Cap is not... Uh, doesn't pair nicely with the pink shovel. Does they both have potions or is it just Ravio? Okay. Just Ravio. Okay. Yeah, they're because they're both spending their health well. <laughs> yeah, they're taking hits, but they're hits that make them go faster. So I'm not I'm just like, huh? Yeah, that's the ticket. Well, keep in mind, Jack, that originally when the DLC was coming out, the order of the zones was going to be randomized, and everybody hated that. <laughs> so now it's this. Yeah, that was terrible. That was I think bad. Jack was in the test. <laughs> yeah, it was really bad. I mean, it was a bold choice, oh. but it was a bad one. All right, we're keeping Monster. it close. Monster yeah, Racer. Yeah, using that scroll to get a little bit ahead here. And finding Trouble. that trap door. And Ravio should find that as well. Yeah, they're going to find it. I think Ravios will be faster because they can run out of the room if they want. They had to kill something first, but yeah. Oh, they got... Yeah, they got... Uh, they got frozen by the Gorgon. Gorgons, yeah. They looked them right in the eyes. Uh, the Snowbro is really good here. Nice shield spell, too, by Ravio. Uh, it's close. I think it's a straight up. No, it's not. It's yeah, that's what it? that was it. I it's remember down. that now. Check starting randomly on zone two and just being like, uh, this feels weird. Oh, that's what it was. Yeah, you still played in order. That's true. Okay, this shield spell is coming in. Whoa, so what nice. happened there? Did we have a vacation Minotaur? Yes, we did. Oh no, that and might cost. Ravio was just was monster. just able to, uh, you know, shield spell the Minotaur and. Oh wow! 
carp them right in the face. That Minotaur went on a huge vacation up north and, uh, yeah, grew a big beard. How does the harp do damage? Is it just like you're so bad at it that it like hurts? Yep. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's <laughs> it. Thanks. Confirmed. Yeah, some nice uh, lures here. So for those who don't know, when you're fighting the Necrodancer, if you've played this game before, but you maybe don't see why they're standing still so much, it's because they're trying to stand in a particular tile that's going to actually pull the Necrodancer towards you. That was a really excellent fight from Ravio. Ravio it's is like, going to oh, take game three. Yeah, she's you, Ravio. And the potion may coming in clutch for Ravio. Um, Vacation Minotaur coming in anti-clutch for Monster. Yeah, that was a huge difference between the two. Um, yeah, I think that I don't have as much a complaint about Zone 5 being the final zone as some people because it's a fun zone. I don't care. <laughs> like, it doesn't have to get harder each time. That seems like just like I want my games to get harder every level, but it doesn't have to. That's fun. <laughs> it's a good time. The wire everywhere, that's a great mechanic. People like it. Like, you know, I like my games to be fun. It is best of five. It is, yes. Yeah, I just reiterate that. This is the losers um, finals. And traditionally, we've always run the losers finals as a best of five, just to make sure yeah. that we really do pick the person who belongs in the grand finals. It's also you get more epic races to That's watch. That's right. It's the good stuff. Yeah, true, Jack. Absolutely. Yeah, I feel the same way. There's a lot of really great things we can say about this game. Um, I think a big reason, not to toot our own horn or anything, but a big reason why this game is so awesome is because it really was, um, they really embraced the early access appropriately, I think, and uh, allowed for the game to get sort of molded together in a way that, you know, I think sure. a lot of people agreed. Was the right, right way like they, this game to go. BYG has been one of the most responsive to like critiques and asks from their player base in early access that I've seen and been a part of. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I mean, one of the main, um, you know, if there is one lesson for game design that at least I know about <laughs> is, and I'm not a game designer, but from what I know, is that like. It's important as a game designer to be happy to kill your sacred cows. You can't just like keep something in a game just because you think it's good, even if people oh, don't think it's good. Yeah. And there's yeah. a few things in this game that I think that happened where it was like, it's a cool idea, but it really doesn't work. Or, this is just not a not a good plan, or, you know? Sure. And so um, I think having the early access, throwing your game to the wolves essentially and letting the community, you know, rip the it apart. and internet community. Yeah, yeah. Um, I think yeah. makes it really better point. for it. That's a really good point. Like, yeah, as a person developing a game, like, yeah, you're probably gonna get attached to some things. Right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You get attached to your own game, and then you st start making decisions that you think is good, or this is how it was meant to be, or trying to keep it. You know, it's a sacred idea, and it's like. It's really not helpful. Right. <laughs> Doesn't matter how right. much you like it <laughs> if you're making a game for other people. Nay. <laughs> uh, also, with the roguelike roguelite thing, um, yeah, I'm pretty over roguelite. Ooh. I don't use it because just use what's colloquial. Language is fluid. It's flexible. <laughs> just use what people okay. use the thing that makes people understand <laughs> what you're saying. Yeah, roguelike Ravio, and roguelike. You, you, no, okay, Ravio's got some sneaky peeks. Oh no. Uh, this oh, is no. danger. Oh, oh no. The 2 1 transmute <laughs> oh, no, two of your one. weapon yeah. is such a yeah. bad idea. <laughs> and now he's got a one damage longsword. Ravio, that the, is a costly mistake. Yeah. <laughs> the table uh, for where it, like, yeah, the item table is different depending on the level. And the farther down you are, the better. Items you see, I didn't. I didn't little bunny ears there. When I said better, but just the general premise. Yeah, yeah, I, I agree. Actually, uh, holy smokes, Monster Racers build right now is really nice. This is like the Elad build. <laughs> it's like boots of pain and a broadsword. Yes, please. 
right love and it. so i was trying to say it's not just how far down you are in the whole game it's like the two one or two two and it could be like one one it's also yeah. bad yeah the right? x one. one so d regardless of the depth if you're on level one of that depth yeah. it's going to be a bad item uh table there's still good items in the pool but overall it's worse and so we're going to take that Obsidian Broad Boots of Pain as well for Ravio. Um, it's a really good combo. This is nice. So you attack at range, but also you have a nice little swipey swipe to the side. Ah, uh, sure. I see what you're saying. To cover your, your corners, to cover the blind spots. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's nice. That and, like, Boots of Pain are just so good. Like, you can see them activating for Monster Racer while sliding on ice. I love that that's mm -hmm. a thing. I'm so glad it is. I I distinctly remember uh, a race, I think it was against Jack, and I just like didn't take Boots of Pain, so I'm like, they're not that good. And I got crushed for like <laughs> a minute, and I'm like, oh man, they're they really are that good. Just that good. They really are. Ooh, a Ring of Peace. Nice little transmute for that Ring of Peace there. And some armor too. An excellent Conjure Shop for Monster. See if Ravio finds that. Ravio's still a little ways back. Dropping into 3 3 now. I think it's over here on the right. Yeah, there it is. I just got a quick peek of it. How is Monster, like, ahead? I'm, I'm a little confused. Was it just, like, better zone one? He's just been maintaining a lead, I think, from the start. Um, There was a glass spear pickup that I think helped. Sure. But, yeah, I'm not sure. And the armor. Yeah. So, Ravio is definitely paying attention to what Monster does. Um. Ooh, do you swap to the Ring of Pain? I don't think you absolutely. do. Absolutely. absolutely. I don't think you do. Yeah, 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 for sure. Why? It's way better. Because uh, piercing damage, piece? right? Like there's. Yes, I think it's faster than peace. Uh. All right. I mean, for me, it's like a lot of feels good, right? You're just like running into enemies and they're falling apart, even Blade Masters. So, to me, it feels better to to play it, but. Monster just getting a food show. <laughs> Can't afford anything. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Had to kill here. Monster getting totally bailed here by this food shop. That is a big orange armadillo. Oh that my gosh. A huge armadillo. <laughs> Yike. Always the food shop. Yeah, that was a good <gasps> find. Nice earth. All the earths. Excellent oh man, earth plays. Yeah, that was an awesome exit for both. And we are tied here. Now do you swap to this? You take the ring of uh, regen. Nope. 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 Keep that pain. All right. I guess pain's the play. I don't know. I still think I that peace is good here. You could go for regen with your spells, right? Like you have such good spells. It's true. Or, or two slots, basically. Huh? Oh, this is close. Ravio here looking to close this out. Go to the grand finals. Monster trying to stay in the tournament. Needing a win. This is... This is incredibly close. Both earthing fortissimal oh, getting into zone so five. Close. Yeah, this is awesome. What a race. The pain broadsword, you love to see it. The only thing better yeah, it's is a fun, the uh, it's a fun race build, right? Like yeah. see how well they're doing. Like it's good. But not like ideal. Right? Yeah, there's the, no rapier, there's no lunge. You wanna you wanna avoid uh snag. The racer who avoids the most snag is gonna be the winner, I think. And we're seeing monster got through that a little bit snaggy less. Oh. Is monster gonna check this trapdoor room? No. He's going for the well, potion, they, well, but the potion. oh, and he's yeah, just taking those. Okay, so Ravio now has the lead. Yeah. But uh, no I was potion. I thinking Ravio was gonna get ahead because monster didn't have the uh, torch of foresight. Traps. Yeah. Yeah. All right. This okay. is pretty good. Set up for some fireballs. Taking oh, hits. What's the draw, my monster? Okay, that was really good. All right. Jeez, this is so close. This is so close. Monster needs a win here. We're going to see another Oblivion. Seems as though Ravio's just sticking with Oblivion, but I don't know. This might be off track. It is off track. Whoa. Ravio went with Oblivion oh, here instead of like a that blood? Earth play was really Push clutch. Down. What a clutch Push play down. in the tunnel. That, that's going to put him behind. Oh, yeah. He, he oh, messed yeah. up his Oblivion, but that was a really awesome recovery. Monster just tunneling in. I love the tunnel. I think that was Ravio. Ravio had the tunnel, right? No, I'm, I'm sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, uh, tunneling into the Necrodancer. Like oh, you that, that, yeah, yeah, yeah. Take your drum and your shovel, and you just kind of take a lesson from the Unholy Mole and oh, dig right. Ravio goes down. 
Great as Monster wins it. Insane race. And we're going to game five. You love to see it. Let's check that out again. I love this recovery. This whole... Okay, so what happens here is there's a little too much snag on this Oblivion right here. So um, waste a little bit too much time with that rider uh, and then was a little rejected. wrong with the timing. But then look yeah. at this recovery. I mean, takes a hit there, but... Oh, yeah. I love setting up that little earth, little pavilion <laughs> to redirect. It's great. I want to see it again. They're still typing in the, they're still, you know. That second attack was the, was the problem. Right here. Look at this. Oh, cool. Yeah, that, that earth was really good. The, sec, the first earth was really, really good. Yeah, love it. All right. Game five losers finals. Winner of this goes to the Grands. Loser cool. goes home. And yeah, broadsword run. Monster Racer winning a broadsword race. Funny. Monster Racer really doesn't like the broadsword. Yeah, these are some uh, expert players there, Pendle. Yeah. These are, these are the easily... Yeah, it's not... You know, I feel like the game is currently at its highest skill, and it oh, just man. keeps going I love up. Both of them luring the dragon down to the by the wall with a torch on it, so they could use their infernal torch. Mm -hmm. Taking Build the awareness. wall, doing eight damage. It's now, so good. Wait, is this the fifth for five whip starts? Oh, or is it four out of five? Because we've had a whip like every <laughs> single race. <laughs> I feel like uh, Ravi is actually in a better position right now, being behind, because they get to see the item that monster picks. Like, yeah. monster has to pick something blind. But it's a dangerous gambit being behind monster, because he's so okay. fast. Okay, sure, sure. I agree. I mean, Ravi is playing the build differential, which, I'll be honest, that might play better with Spooty. Hmm. Because I think Spooty's whole plan is to not have a build differential and go faster than you. And so if your sure. main focus is getting a build differential, then maybe maybe Ravio's got the better shot on Spooty. Because of course Spooty is waiting currently in the in the grand finals for the winner of this. Waiting in the winners are uh, yeah. Oh, is that a oh Ravio getting a potion. Nice noticing mm -hmm. potion rooms, trying to buy all those tier two walls. Yeah, that can be clutch. This uh armadillo is in a really this, annoying uh, spot. Armadillo is kind of a jerk though. Yeah. You could just kill it with the uh, uh the holy water. Uh, Ravio, please. This is wasting uh, so much time. This is like some puzzle door action. Like how do I what do I <laughs> Oh no. Yikes. Yeah, that gives monsters such a big lead. Like, they have time to go to this shop and find something nice. Oh, man. Okay. What Thank was the chest? Oh, no. What do we got? Uh, like good thing he's got a potion. Okay, are we gonna... Oh, we're gonna bomb. Could it's also have fully watered. Looks like Obsidian Rapier. I think Monster opened a Thinky Tom Shrine. And it is an Obsidian Rapier. I think you are correct. Um, and yeah. I think Ravio is oh, missing purple. out. Wait, what was the purple? Oh. The purple um, particle effect when you lunge, it looks purple. So you know that it's... Uh... No, purple chest. Uh, uh, monster just lost their obsidian rape here. I and think decided not to go back for it. I think chat's saying it's a, is it a cutlass or a rape here. Wait, what? It's definitely a rape here. What is monster, going on? Uh, monster, yeah, they... <laughs> Uh, yeah, the elemental killed the shop. They left their oh, uh, no. rapier in the shop. Oh, I see. Just okay, like what we saw Rabio do. Yeah, exactly. The monster was trying to do that, but Why an aren't elemental you... was behind. Oh. And so they cut off the exit. So Insane. they couldn't go back into their shop. Oh, man. Huge yeah, advantage so, to Rabio uh, now. Rabio. <laughs> nice dodge on that red dragon. Oh, three bomb pack. Delightful. Yeah, this is so spicy now for, for Monster. Monster's going to have to stick with using the shield, getting a we uh, It's not a weapon. Grenade charm. Oh, this is a scary exit. Yep, nice pause there. Absolutely what I was thinking. You know what? That's the big brain plays right there we love to see. Monster Racer, mm. knowing that it was a spooky exit, there was enemies nearby, didn't want to break his glass. 
mm -hmm. using the pause buffer. Wise choice. And there okay. is a Nade Zuma. Nade okay, Zuma. we're tied. It's still okay. tied here. I Abigail's mean... gonna check purple. Mm. Oh yeah, mm. Monster couldn't take really take that uh, that Telemonkey without a huge risk. Getting a shovel, Ooh, getting some forced. armor. Yeah, this is good pickups for Ravio, but Ravio's got to start pushing oh, now. Boy. This is exactly that thing we were talking about. Like, do you want to be behind Monster Racer, even with the better build? Did you check out that shop? No. Okay. I, I mean, I okay. checked that shop, but I'm yeah, not I in the finals. I would too. I'd be like, <laughs> I want to get rid of this glass harp and... I check it because <laughs> morbid curiosity would make me check it. I'd be like, well, wait, what sure. if it's like Ring of Mana something good? I don't know. Oh, the shop is dead. Well, I would still check it and then find out that it's dead. Yeah, 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 for sure. <laughs> I asked the question thinking I would go look at this shop. Oh, and I would definitely spicy check it the shop. Please kill that bomblin. Thank you. Oh, boy. Do they have... No, they don't even have a luck charm. Monster oh, Ranger does exit. not have a luck charm. That exit was so swag for Ravio. The pulse on the mini boss plus the Yo, wall monster. pig. Monster with the grenades. Yeah, and chucking the grenades. Monster's oh, in the man. lead here. He's got the far weaker build, but... Yo. Hey, just... they switched off. Okay, they can take a hit. Yep. Same weapon, but a little bit uh, safer. And there goes the potion for Ravio. Ravio's got to push here. Again, This it all comes down to this zone 5. Who's going to take yeah. the win? Are we going to see a rematch of Spooty versus Monster? Or is Ravio going to take it? Ravio, who's been farming up a lot this run. Does Monster have any grenades left? No. Three grenades, not enough. Yeah, he needs they to can't, keep they can't those. Yeah. Any. Yeah, three bombs for Ravio as well. Okay, it's close. Sure. Yeah, this is. <laughs> hey, they're in the same hallway. They're like at school, passing each other. Yeah. They're pushing each other into the garbage can. They're giving each other dirty looks. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> some... Swirlies. Oh, that knockback, though, is so good. Oh, I love the pulse. And it's Ravio taking the lead with the far superior oh. build. He's got it. He's got that build. Now you're not going to find any um, trap doors. This is the way, though. He dug through. Oh, we got some the Mandalorian pulse. from Elad. The nice pulse. pulse. No, get some bonks. Okay, oh, monster. my God. Monster has half a heart. Monster's got... I don't... Oh. Yeah, I mean, Ravio probably wins. But, you know, there's a chance. I don't know. There are nades. There's nades. Oh, that, that, um, that uh, knockback. knockback? Sketchy. What was that? Sketchy is what it was. Whoa. Okay, Monster Racer, oh, monster. half a heart still in this. Oh, man. I yeah, the was... nades are faster. The nades are faster. I would, my brain would have broken. Had I seen okay. the Half a heart. And the first diagonal. one in there is going to be Monster Racer. He's got one oh, hit monster, already. Yeah. Hit, this hit. is so insane. I can't even. I, swear, I, I swear want both to win. There, I don't want waiting. anybody to win here. I want them both to win. This is not fair. You know, wants a participation <laughs> trophy for just, everybody. Everybody wins. Come on. You're all trying one so hard. Oh my god, Monster Racer's going to take it. Monster Racer, I nice can't dodging. It. I can't believe Holy it. Holy Jamal. Oh, Monster Racer. Insane. <laughs> Are you serious? Monster Racer said, That elemental is not my friend. I can deal without having this obscene rapier. Can't believe it. Wins with a uh, zone four glass oh. heart. After losing his... Okay. Monster has had two pretty critical mistakes. I believe they're both in this set. One was the blood drum. Remember where he that accidentally transmuted it? Booty. Oh, was that, that against was Booty? Booty? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Ooh. And he lost that one, but this one, he managed to push that glass harp to the finish. Okay, well, he switched to a titanium, but still. That was so good. That was so good. Oh my god, I can't believe it. And so we're, the rematch is set. Our uh, one and two seeds are going to find themselves in the grand finals. Oh man, that was awesome. Oh man. <laughs> it was so good. Uh, yeah, zone four. Yeah, exactly. Ain't done. That that zone four was incredible. It's so good. Oh, you love to oh, see it. Man. All right. Well, we're gonna take a very short break and then get into this final set, the grand finals featuring Spooty Biscuit Spooty and Monster Racer.